speaker. I rise to honor the 23 Pueblos and tribes in New Mexico. This week, New Mexicans observed our first Indigenous Peoples Day, celebrating the lengthy history and ongoing contributions of Native American communities in New Mexico. New Mexico's past, present, and future is tied to the vibrancy of its Native American sovereign governments. One of the most serious threats facing these communities is the crisis of murdered and missing women. The murder, murder rate for Native American women is 10 times higher than the national average. And we have trouble even counting these tragedies. Due to outdated databases and insufficient coordination between law enforcement agencies, we can't count the number of Native American women who go missing each and every year. This crisis demands a response, and I am proud and honored to join my colleagues, Congresswoman Norma Torres, Congressman Dan Newhouse, and Congresswoman Deb Holland in co-sponsoring H.R. 2733, Savannah's Act. Savannah's Act improves tribal access to federal databases, creates new guidelines for responding to these cases, and creates grant programs for law enforcement agencies to improve their practices. Thank you, and I yield back the remainder of my time.